uh, social distancing. Ooh, pretty cool. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Right, we're out again. We're out with uh, South East Metal Detecting Shop and Rallies. I think we just started, we just had our briefing by Luke, the old people behind us. And uh, it's the first field. Uh, social distancing. There's a magpie down there. He's just sorting himself out. Right, well, I guess we'll see you on the first thousand, guys, eh? See you in a sec. All right, so we've got a number 19 here, guys. On the old knock seat. So it must be very big, because it's going to be near the surface by the looks of it. So I don't need to dig up the bloody big hole after all. And it is... Ah, just a bit of tap. A little bit of copper. Not really what you wanted, was it? Oh well, let's carry on. Alright, see what we've got in this hole there. What's that going to be? That looks a bit like a button to me. And it's a button. Yeah. A little four hole button. Nothing special. Let's carry on. Alright, so we've got a uh, number 12. I was reluctant to dig it, to be honest. Yeah, I was reluctant to dig that because uh, I was thinking shotgun shell, number 12. But actually, it's still a bullet, but it's a bullet. It's not a shotgun shell. It's not so bad, eh? I'd uh, rather dig them with shotgun shells, that's for sure. Probably a 303 tip, I imagine, by the shape of it. Alright, let's carry on. Alright, guys, just found something pretty decent by the looks of it here. Um, pendant of some description. Yeah, there might be silver. Beef pin. Religious icon. Ooh, pretty cool. Alright, let's clean that up and have a look, see, eh? Alright, guys, we've got Mr. Marquez here and he's going to show us something really awesome. No. Oh my oh, god. Oh, oh what? <laughs> look at that, look. Uh, wow, look at that. Wow, look at that. Yeah. Can I feel the weight of that? Yeah, of course you can. Oh, you can take it out of the box yeah, and all? Yeah, that's right. Oh. Found out, so. Yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous, to be fair. You'd be surprised with the weight. Oh, yeah, that's heavy. But yeah, 600 years old, four inches under the ground, right by the gate. It's look mad, isn't it? That. It's mad how that was. Do you know, I spent ages trying to find out what that was when I saw the photo. Because Lee, Lee, Lee sent me a photo, yeah. and I thought, I've just got a bit of on coins. <laughs> Let's have a look, see what it is. Yeah. I couldn't find it. I, I, Alex sent me a bit, it wasn't the right one, but yeah, one is Oh, wow, look at that. One Spanish cob. One Spanish cob? cob. Yeah, one, uh, one is scooter, so it's a, a Spanish scooter. cob, yeah, so it's, it's the balloon basically, it's pirate money. Well, wow. Yeah, so I'm going to be. Uh, that's another little boat that I found. Uh, but it fits perfectly in the in the coin cases. That's nice. That is really nice. Yeah. Where'd you get that? Is this like little off box? E no, it's off eBay. I sent oh, you really? Tom sent me the link. Yeah, it's really. It's they're so good, man. You get loads of like the, the material to put it all in and the foam. You just cut the foam out. Really? But yeah, it's perfect. Other than that, they were just in a box randomly by himself. So. There you go, guys. So um, you want to get yourself a coin box? We're, we should get the link off young Tom here, yeah, go on and uh, we'll put that in down the description if you want to get yourself one of them boxes. Yeah, go on the photo searches. Uh, um, <laughs> shame, <laughs> shame, shameless shame plug there. <laughs> yeah, I'll scroll down. There is a link on the, uh, on the Facebook page there for you. Well, well done. Go check that out. Right, okay, guys, you heard it here first. All right, so that come up. I guess that's probably off a parasail, you know, an umbrella. I think that's what it looks like to me anyway. If I'm wrong, comments in the description. Right, we're in a new field now, it's just been opened up because uh, I think some of the other fields have been a bit quiet really, so everyone's going mad. 
all swinging. Look, look, Mr. Marquet's over there, look. He's going like that, no tomorrow. Swing, 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 swing. Ooh, pretty cool. Oh, well, there's all the cows coming back in again. But now it's up, two for two. I don't know, I feel about 50 cows at least. And they'll follow two sheep. Mr. Fitzpatrick, he's uh, stunned by him. We've done per day pretty much. Um, it's not a huge amount today, but you've got to walk over it to find it, eh? 